Right, now today I want to talk about pistons. And they are a very important part of a motor car because they, they're the ones that go up and down and create the, 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 the power that you derive from the engine. Now, in this particular case, we have these special pistons made for the Austin 7. And uh, these particular ones are slightly oversized, they're 56.5 millimeters in diameter. And they're made, and they're beautifully made. Um, and they're made like this, they're called slipper pistons, which means that they have no metal at the sides here. And the gudgeon pins are held in place by little circlips at each end. And the gudgeon pins also tapered to cut the weight down. So you have these amazing little pistons, which are copied from the original Austin ones, but they are very, very special. And these are the 56.5 diameter pistons. These are slightly bigger than standard. So if you want to bore the engine out, you can do. And so that's, uh, that's an Austin 7 slipper piston. And um, now one of the things I wanted to talk to you about today is engine balance. Now, Years and years ago, when I raced the Marcos at the Nürburgring, I got very friendly with a chap called Keith Duckworth, who ran a business called Cosworth Engineering. And he explained to me that they never balanced their engines, the works engines, at all. But what they did do was they did balance the pistons, because the instantaneous centre of rotation of a piston around the crankshaft is near enough infinity, and that's a huge amount of distance. So the slightest out of balance on a piston can make a massive difference to the balance of an engine. So what you have to do is to make sure that all of these pistons are exactly the same weight. Now, many years ago, we did some experiments at Vauxhall Motors when I worked there, and they, what they did was they made these pistons out of balance on purpose. And they made and they went through the whole engine making other parts of the piston other, other parts of the engine out of balance as well like the flywheel crankshaft con rods and so on and they didn't make the slightest difference but when they put the pistons out of balance the engine shook itself to pieces so it just gives you a rough idea of what we're talking about here and that keith duckworth who was a brilliant engineer made the most famous formula one engines ever um knew exactly what he was talking about so balance your pistons. Don't balance the rest of the engine. It's just a waste of money. Thank you very much.